Welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 as the Soviet Union. We left off last episode not really gaining much damn ground, to be honest. Did dispatch a new army to Southeast U.S., which is our biggest stronghold. Decided to send more troops to Texas. And I adjusted their formations. Where his formation will only be from here to the coast. And his formation will take over there and go back down around to the coast. I also planned another invasion. Sadly, I'm going to have to figure out how to gain naval superiority. Uh... I don't think that we got much threats over here, so let's just go ahead and split our Pacific subs. I'm not sure what number fleet we are on, so we'll just call it 15. Do some convoy raiding. There, there. there. Hopefully that will do the job. Although that invasion is a hundred days out because they're taken off from one spot. But that's okay. This guy is waiting for this fleet who is suffering some casualties. Actually, it looks like he's almost ready to go back out. We should add to his numbers. What is his situation? Just give him some more destroyers. Production. Destroyers. Light cruisers, heavy cruiser, and I'm going to give him a carrier. Just give him a little bit more, wrong one, a little bit more firepower. It'll take a while to get to him, but any casualties he suffers will be replaced at that point in time. Let's get this bad boy rolling. Wasted enough time. Zukov, go. If we can wear them down. Oh, I also sent some troops, some more troops into New England. 19 divisions. That's a start. It may be too much. It may hurt us. But I'm hoping it doesn't. What did he say? Him. He's the one I sent. Fear not. Fear not. I got plenty to fear right now. Not really. It's only a matter of time before the war of attrition ends in our favor. Royce. You need to be in North America. Even though the majority of your troops are not. And who was the dude in Africa? Got off. You need to be in North America. And 
Zukov failed to break through again. He's confident, and he hasn't even turned around and got any troops there yet. supply issues but I can't take advantage of it. It's sad. What do you say? Whatever you said, I agree. I think. Now, why in the world is he trying to cut this? Try a massive attack. Wait a minute, you're not even there yet. Maybe if we push hard everywhere, we can turn around and break through. So far, it's looking pretty good, actually. Switch back to North. No, there we go. As long as somebody's taking it. Dude, stop that. You're overextending yourself. I know you got more divisions coming, but stop it. Look at all of these fortifications. That's our problem. That's why it's trench warfare. They fortified everything. I really have to start being more aggressive. We should have more territories. And we do. Texas and Louisiana. Good deal. Could the tide be a turn in? I doubt it. Ace pilot promoted. <sighs> All kinds of problems up here. How did we get control of Louisiana? It just doesn't make any sense. Get up. Oh, 
Oh, he arrived. All right, try your luck. So far, it looks pretty good. Can we achieve a breakthrough? I doubt it. But how about a little bit more breathing room? I'd be happy with that. I'd be happy with just a little bit more breathing room. Let's give the rest of those armies a break. Including you, why are you unsupplied? Why are you having supply issues? Uh, it's... Uh, maybe these, these territories are destroyed. That's a problem. There's Louisiana. There's Mississippi. There's Texas. There's Tennessee. Right, let's see how they did in the Northeast. Well, okay, we got a little bit of breathing room. I'm nothing worth riding home and bragging about, but. We got control of Texas. Is he ready for his assault? No. But you have permission to go. When you're ready, do it. Alright. You. You gotta succeed eventually. Come on now. Java has been successful so far. I'm going to finish taking all of these islands. And then we're going to invade Australia with the Marines. See if the Marines can handle it. Yeah, got off. He has permission to go. He's just waiting on the Navy to come back. The Navy is coming back. Where are they? Oh, he failed. Yes. Oh. He failed. That means he ran into resistance at every location. I'm going to have to stick with my plans. I am not I going to use the Marines to bail them out. They can keep on banging their head against that wall for all I care. Get off with me, Gutsa. Try again. You got a green light? Go for it if you're feeling that confident. Oh, 
hell. Okay. I thought their orders disappeared. I was like, no wonder you're saying <laughs> It's a little bit annoying. Sailors. Okay, take a break. Free civilian factories. Take a break. You're not going anywhere. Take a break. Take a break. Work on your plans. Oh boy, you got supply issues. Let's build some more ports. Oh hell, we can't. But, we do have control of Kentucky now. And New Jersey. And New York? Really? Sweet. Can build another port up here somewhere. Just prove upon one that already we captured New York City. Ha ah, damn. Unless that's someone else. Yeah, that's damn Spanish. Okay. My job, my job. Dude. Where are your troops at? There they are. Twenty-three divisions. Yeah, I feel good about twenty-three. Send our twenty-three divisions over here. Give you a new set of orders. Something a little bit like that. Oh, and we got well, DC surrounded. Good deal. Okay, let's push again. We are all being very confident. Even you. Waiting. See how that invasion turns out. We have invaded Mexico now as well. And so close to connecting our fronts. wonder you don't have any fresh orders oh you no, you do have fresh orders and what in the holy hell is going on 
24 divisions, Army 2, that's you. Never mind. You have orders. And we have connected our fronts. With a little bit of help from a Spanish invasion, I guess. But hey, I'll take the help where I can get it. Any more territories? Yes, we have Pennsylvania under our control. Arkansas. And a couple territories in Mexico. Uh-oh. Our invasion isn't going very well. They actually have five divisions on the ground. But we have connected our southern fronts. Royce! Dude, you need new orders now. I'm not sure what to give you. Let's just give you that for now. And just go. You'll be fine. extremely awkward aspect of this is I didn't expect the US to hold out this long what the hell are their casualties at 19 million so they've lost another 3 million and they're right on the edge of capitulation we need to just go then it'll get real ugly There it is. The U.S. has capitulated. Okay. Got up. Extend your line all the way across. You are in charge of moving south. Hell, I could bring over all your divisions Bullshit. now. So, just do it. You'll be fine. Uh, let's put 25 divisions on this order, though. Oh, Zuki, Zuki, Zuki. That's kind of crazy looking. I think you can pull it off. Troops. Oh man, I hate when you do that. No. No, 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 no. Stop that. How about just there? You're not going to be able to handle that because you don't like it. They're willing to 
I don't even know how to explain how the AI does this. 24 divisions. You're actually in pretty good condition. I'll be your marching orders for now. I'm going to give him the corner. This guy, I'm probably going to try to give him the entire front as backup for defense. He should have no problem landing now, but looks like he's going to have a problem landing anyways. Craziness, right? But, wrong one. Where is... Try it again. Oh, man. We're about ready to lose five divisions. Who the hell are these, anyways? Can't make them out. Don't know. Oh, I got it paused. What the hell? There we go. It's the Caleb C. Oh, yeah, that one would be stopping us. They got one division, and I can't defeat it. Yeah, these guys are pretty damn green, let me tell you. I'm going to have to restructure my attack, put all the divisions in the center attack. And then try to break through it. Yeah, I got no choice. Royce! Oh hell, did I just cancel my attack? I think I did. That's all right. No. Yeah, got All of you guys. Go there. And try not to die on the beaches. And where did our 24 go? Close. Here they come. Running back. Go ahead, go back. I'll send you to Australia. Or Borneo. One of the two. Because Canada, Australia, and Mexican opposition are considered the major powers now. But we are out of time, people, so we're going to have to pause it right here. We have defeated the United States. Now we have a bunch. What would I call them? Pissant superpowers? Canada, Mexico, Australia, Pasha. They are going down. Hopefully next episode. Anyways, I want to thank all of you. I really do appreciate all each and every last one of you. So until I see you all again tomorrow, bye-bye.